Hey YouTube, it's Tia. Um, Shiloh is going to be four months old in three days. So this will be his four month update. Um, everything's been going really good. Um, he's a tank. He's already 17 pounds. He's huge. I'll show you guys. He's a big boy. Um, he's in uh, three to six month clothes. So, I mean, I guess he's really long. So, he's 25 inches almost. Um, I think he's like 24 and a half. Um, but, yeah, he's been doing really, really good. He eats some solid foods now, like he eats pears and apricots and peaches and uh, bananas. Like, he eats the fruit. He hates vegetables right now like he he'll it, it'll make him throw up if I feed it to him so um and then what else I put I right now he's on uh soy Similac and um he eats about like two to four ounces at a time so he doesn't eat too much and then um I have to put rice cereal in his bottle because he has baby acid reflux and it helps him from puking um so yeah i have him on that and then he heard it's a cranky but <laughs> um he sleeps almost through the night he was sleeping from 10 o'clock at night until eight o'clock in the morning he was on that routine for about from two months to three months and then from three months to four months, he's been waking up at two and five, but he goes to bed at 7.30 now. So, yeah, so go to bed at 7.30, wakes up at two, eats a bottle, goes back to sleep until five, wakes up and eats a bottle, and then he'll sometimes go back to sleep until like 7.38, um, just depending on how tired he is. But, um, yeah, being a stay-at-home mom is a lot of fun, but it's really boring like you got to keep yourself busy or you just you get bummed out um or like you just get stir crazy I guess but um we're in our we've been in our new house since about a month before I had him and it's really nice it's like the living room is the size of our old house so um it's really nice I could probably give you guys a little tour but um I don't know it's kind of messy right now, so I might not, <laughs> but, um, yeah, I, I love being a mom, it's a lot of fun, it's definitely an experience, I didn't expect it to be anything like it is, it's crazy, and he is a crazy wild child, so, um, he's a lot of work, but he's a lot of fun too, and he, oh, things that he does now, he rolls over, um, from front to back and from back to front, but he doesn't really do it a lot yet. He's, he still kind of is trying to figure it out. Um, he says, mama, hi. He can kind of do high five. You want to do high five? High five. No? He, he'll, he'll like touch his hand to mine. I'm trying to get him to learn it. Um. He almost sits up on his own. He's really, really trying. Um, he laughs like crazy, especially when you hold him up in the air. I don't know if he's going to do it right now because he's kind of grumpy. But if you go like this, he'd go, you see chubby, 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 chubby. I said, chubby, chubby, chubby. Yeah, he's kind of laughing. He's smiling. You see chubby, 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 chubby. No, he's not going to do it. I'm just too grumpy right now. Um, but yeah. <laughs> um, I think that is pretty much everything that he does right now. He's not starting to crawl. He, I mean, he's held his head up since the day he was born, so like that's nothing new. Um, he's, I don't know. He's a really good baby, and I love him. He's my little pumpkin. He loves to cuddle. And when he gets angry, instead of just, like, screaming, he'll, if I'm holding him, he'll put his head into my shoulder and just, like, scream cry into my chest. Oh, you okay? 
Yeah, he'll like put his head into my shoulder and like scream cry into my chest. It's sad. But, oh, we got tag sticking out. Anyways, uh, oh my god, he looks huge on this camera. He's not this big. Um. What? Tell me, man. Tell me about it. We just go. Who's a baby? Who's a baby? Is that you? <laughs> You're just too grumpy for this right now, huh? He loves the knee bounce. If he's grumpy, he loves the knee bounce. Or, um. Oh, going upside down. He thinks being upside down is really funny. So I, I'll, like, hold him by his sides and turn him upside down, and he thinks it's hilarious. Um, and, yeah, I think that's about it. I have, oh, my God, I'm, like, I plateaued out on my weight. I can't lose anymore. Like, I I haven't been trying, so, um, but I dropped 30 pounds since labor, I have 30 left to go, um, and it sucks. <clears throat> um, so I found these all-natural diet pills. I don't know if I'm going to take them because they're one molecule off of, like, being mess, I guess. But they're called ACE, and everything else is all-natural in it. Um, the... I don't know. I guess the, the, the only reason why I don't want to is because of the side effects. It pretty much makes you feel cracked out, which is not what I want. But I don't, I don't know. And then I'm gonna start going to the gym um, one to two times a week, or two, not one to two, sorry, one to two times a day for the first two weeks. And then um, I'm gonna just try and go once a day. Um, I've been working out like off and on, not really consistently, and I've been eating healthy, but I can't drop the extra weight. Like I have a tire around my stomach, and it sucks. And I'm also gonna go do red light therapy to get rid of my stretch marks. Um, you guys can research it because it's really hard to explain. So if you want to know what it is, um, it's pretty much just like a tanning bed. But you guys can research it, and um, I think I might go do that because I have my stretch marks are awful. Like, I have them everywhere. Oh, sad boy. What's wrong? You just so tired. You need a nap. Anyways, I'm going to go put him down for his nap. Um, But I will try and update with you guys again soon. I'm really sorry. It always takes forever. So, um, Oh, and we're going to take our first big road trip with him on the 4th to Portland to go see my friend Katie. Um. So, yeah. Anyways, I will talk to you guys soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.